In today's video, I'm going to teach you how to add birthdays to your Outlook calendar. This can be a handy way to keep track of those special days and ensure you never miss out on celebrating with friends and family. For this guide, we'll be using Microsoft Outlook's web version, but the steps are quite similar on the desktop application as well. First, let's start by opening Microsoft Outlook in your preferred web browser. Simply navigate to Microsoft's official page and look for the Outlook section. Once there, you'll find the sign in button located at the top right corner of the page. Click on that and enter your email address followed by your password to log in. If you don't have an account yet, you'll need to create one, but today we'll assume you're already set up. Now that you're logged into Outlook, turn your attention to the left hand side of the interface. You'll see several icons, locate the calendar icon and give it a click. This will open the calendar view where you can see your schedule laid out typically by month, week or even day, depending on your last used settings. The next step is to pick the specific month and day where you want to add a birthday. You can easily do this by clicking directly on that date within your calendar view. Once you've selected the date, you'll likely notice a prompt or blank event form where you can enter the details of your new event. Here's where the personalization begins. You'll want to select the time of the event. Now, even though birthdays generally last all day, you have the flexibility to specify a start time if there's a particular moment you're planning something. However, choosing all day is usually the simplest way to set up a birthday, allowing you to focus on celebrating rather than micromanaging times. With the date and time in place, the next action is to make sure all these details are saved correctly. So locate the save button, typically located at the top or bottom right of your window, and click on it. This action confirms all the details you've entered, adding the birthday to your calendar. Congratulations, you've just added a birthday to your Outlook calendar. From now on, Outlook will remind you of this special day depending on your notification settings, leaving you free to plan a fantastic celebration. Remember these steps the next time you need to add a recurring reminder or any special day to your calendar. It's all about maintaining organization while making sure you keep those vital connections strong. Thanks for joining today and I hope you found this guide useful.